Bible Scriptures on Money and Prosperity Let your conversation be without covetousness, and be content with such things as ye have. For he hath said, I will never leave thee, nor forsake thee. Hebrews chapter 13, verse 5 Wealth gotten by vanity shall be diminished, but he that gathereth by labor shall increase. Proverbs chapter 13, verse 11 But they that will be rich fall into temptation and a snare, and into many foolish and hurtful lusts, which drown men in destruction and perdition. 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 9 Labor not to be rich, cease from thine own wisdom. Proverbs chapter 23, verse 4 The blessing of the Lord it maketh rich, and he addeth no sorrow with it. Proverbs chapter 10, verse 22 He that loveth silver shall not be satisfied with silver, nor he that loveth abundance with increase. This is also vanity. Ecclesiastes chapter 5, verse 10. Honor the Lord with thy substance, and with the firstfruits of all thine increase. Proverbs chapter 3, verse 9. Better is little with the fear of the Lord than great treasure and trouble therewith. Proverbs chapter 15, verse 16. And he said unto them, Take heed and beware of covetousness, for a man's life consisteth not in the abundance of things which he possesses. Luke chapter 12, verse 15. Render therefore to all their dues, tribute to whom tribute is due, custom to whom custom, fear to whom fear, honor to whom honor. Romans chapter 13, verse 7. For where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. Matthew chapter 6, verse 21. But who am I, and what is my people, that we should be able to offer so willingly after this sort? For all things come of thee, and of thine own have we given thee. 1 Chronicles chapter 29, verse 14. How much better is it to get wisdom than gold, and to get understanding rather to be chosen than silver? Proverbs chapter 16, verse 16. Charge them that are rich in this world, that they be not high-minded, nor trust in uncertain riches, but in the living God, who giveth us richly all things to enjoy. 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 17. His Lord said unto him, Well done, thou good and faithful servant. Thou hast been faithful over a few things. I will make thee ruler over many things. Enter thou into the joy of thy Lord. Matthew chapter 25, verse 21. Remove far from me vanity and lies. Give me neither poverty nor riches. Feed me with food convenient for me. Proverbs chapter 30, verse 8. The desire of a man is his kindness, and a poor man is better than a liar. Proverbs chapter 19, verse 22. A little that a righteous man hath is better than the riches of many wicked. For the arms of the wicked shall be broken, but the Lord upholdeth the righteous. Psalm chapter 37, verses 16 to 17. A good name is rather to be chosen than great riches, and loving favor rather than silver and gold. Proverbs chapter 22, verse 1. Wilt thou set thine eyes upon that which is not? For riches certainly make themselves wings, they fly away as an eagle toward heaven. Proverbs chapter 23, verse 5. Treasures of wickedness profit nothing, but righteousness delivereth from death. Proverbs chapter 10, verse 2. Riches profit not in the day of wrath, but righteousness delivereth from death. Proverbs chapter 11, verse 4. I have rejoiced in the way of thy testimonies, as much as in all riches. Psalm chapter 119, verse 14. Give, and it shall be given unto you. Good measure, pressed down and shaken together, and running over, shall men give into your bosom. For with the same measure that ye meet with all, it shall be measured to you again. Luke chapter 6, verse 38. Beloved, I wish above all things that thou mayest prosper and be in health, even as thy soul prospereth. 3 John 2. Thanks for listening. This is Daniel, the creator of Daily Bible Audio. If these Bible verses have been a blessing to you, Please subscribe and share the channel with others if you haven't already. God bless you.